Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Ah, uh, ever came across a situation where you, yourself, and a Muslim friend of yours, didn't talk about the purity of the cutleries where non-Muslims might have used them before you do, or maybe your little brother accidentally made contact a dog's lever? Well, I guess most of you should know about the process when those things happen. Ah, uh, but let us get together. In Islam, according to a hadith narrated by Abu Hurairah. And it's related in Sahih Al Bukhari. He relates that Allah's Messenger said about the matter: "You purify one of your dishes after a dog laps some of its content. You must wash it seven times. One of them with turok." Do you know that all the mazhabs or schools advise the same procedures? And they've also concluded that cleansing is being done when you come across the touching of heavy impurities. In the Malay community, the process is better known as sertu. Impurities of dogs and pigs are considered heavy impurities. These include everything derived from these two animals, all of their kind. You may be wondering, where can we find that in Singapore? Here, or here, and here. Well, fret not, because now we got a solution. The Tohara soap. The soap contains 95% clay, which has been approved for use by the trusted bodies in Malaysia. So now you can use it without any worries. Here's what you got to do to cleanse yourself from the heavy impurities. Clean the part that is affected. Wash seven times, one of which. Use tohara soap to rub on it. Use pure mutlak water for the remaining six washings until the smell, color, and taste are removed. So there it is. Isn't it easy? This has been a production by Islamic Event Dot Directed and developed by Joe.